Welcome to the AIM Insight e-training series presented by AIM Sports, providing support and training for your AIM Sports products when and where you want it. This module is Data Views in Race Studio 2. When looking at your data in Race Studio 2, you have several options available. In this screen we are looking at four graphs displayed. As you can see, when we view multiple graphs at one time, the screen can get very busy. Let's take a look at what graphs we are presenting. Here I have highlighted the GPS speed graph. This is the engine RPM graph. And this is the lateral acceleration graph. And finally this is a graph of the oil pressure. These are all important graphs to view and there is value to looking at them all at the same time. But this method called the overlapped graphs view may not be the best way. Let's open the options pull down menu and see what our viewing choices are. We have three choices. They are this current view called overlapped graphs and we also have mixed graphs and tiled graphs. The options pull down menu is not the only place we can change views. We also have these three icons. The first icon is the overlapped graphs view, the next one is the mixed graphs view, and the last one is the tiled graph view. Now let's look at the next view, the mixed graphs view. Let's click on the mixed graphs icon to change the view. As you can quickly see, the graphs are much easier to view. What has happened is each graph was placed into a window of the main screen based on the highlighted numbers next to the channel names. These are user definable and will allow up to six windows and can include just one or multiple graphs. Let's take a detailed look at this view. In the number one or top window is the GPS speed graph. In the number two window is the engine RPM graph. And in the number three window are two graphs. First is the lateral acceleration graph. And right in the same window is the oil pressure graph. This mixed graphs view is a very popular and powerful way to look at your data. For example, looking at this combination of lateral acceleration and oil pressure graphs in window number three, it is very clear that this car has an issue with losing oil pressure only in the hard left-hand corners. This would have been very hard to see in the overlapped graphs view. Now let's look at the third way to view your graphs, the tiled view. Let's click on the Show Graphs Tiled icon. The graphs tiled view places each graph into a separate window and is a very quick way to separate your graphs. As you can see, the data view functions allow you to quickly view your graphs in different ways and is a very powerful and easy to use tool. For more AIM Insight eTraining content and information about upcoming on-site training seminars, visit www.aimsports.com forward slash support, your source for support and training of AIM Sports products when and where you want it.